Anti-malaria drugs and typhoid drugs are not soup and gary. They ah. must not take them together. Some people have been forced to believe that individually these drugs cannot function effectively. Yes, I understand the aspect of uh, drug synergy, but in this case, it's entirely not the game. Photo. Please, after medical evaluation and you only have malaria, go for anti-malaria drugs. And if you only have typhoid, go for typhoid drugs. Okay, because malaria on its own is caused by a pathogen called plasmodium, which is a protozoan parasite. And typhoid is caused by a bacterium called Salmonella typhi. Okay, so they are two different, uh, they have two different causes, which is very important to know. And if anybody has told you that you must take anti-malaria drug, and typhoid drug before it, uh, it gets better, please. That's a wrong advice. Taking drugs uh, with that when you don't need them is dangerous to your body, most especially that of uh, typhoid. As you know, antibiotics is used to treat typhoid fever, and the severity of the typhoid fever will determine the type of drug to be used. But it's very important to understand that taking antibiotics the wrong way would cause what we call antibiotics resistance. Okay, and it wouldn't be good for you because anytime you need antibiotics and you take them, it will not be effective. So please, anybody telling you that you must take anti-malaria drugs and antibiotics to treat uh, only malaria, that person is deceiving you. Okay, so Anytime you are having both uh, malaria and typhoid, you can take two of them. But if you are having only malaria, just take anti-malaria drugs. Both are not gari and soup. They must never go together. Please share with your friends and loved ones and save somebody.